All right, uh, and Ryan, let's close it out with the Mariners. The Mariners uh, got off to a really nice start. They did make some key yeah. offseason acquisition moves. They signed Robbie Ray. I know they spent some money on him. Um, you know, kind of like the way that they looked at the beginning of the season. Then they went just through this huge drought where they just lost like virtually every game. And then guess what happens, Ryan? They get to play the Washington Nationals, right? I mean, that seems to be the key for everybody <laughs> this season. They play the Nationals, and then they go on some sort of winning streak. They've won 10 in a row. Angels are probably looking at them saying, wait a second, this is where we're supposed to be. What kind of chances right. you give Seattle to make it? Yeah, I mean, they're, they're you know, like the Orioles, they're in a tough division. And it's a different kind of tough division, right? Because the AL East is all good. But in the NL or in the AL West, you still have the Astros. So you're not going to catch them. So you're basically competing against the same teams that the Orioles are competing against when you're talking about the wild card. You know, the thing that I love so much about watching this Seattle team is, is Julio Rodriguez. You know, he's a guy I got a chance to meet very briefly in spring training one day when I was out in, in Phoenix because – he posted on Instagram that he was going to be out around the Mariners complex giving away free stuff to fans, you know, and that's the kind of, that's, that's the kind of, of, of player that, you know, he's obviously a, a potential superstar. I mean, he has the potential to be a Juan Soto, you know, Fernando Tatis Jr. He's that kind of guy. He has that type of talent, you know, and we will get a chance to see that on the big stage with him playing in uh, the all-star game and in the home run derby. I'm not sure he's best suited for the home run derby, even though he does have a lot of pop in his bat, but you know, he's going to have a lot of fun out there. And I think people are going to see what kind of personality this guy has. He's, he's got a chance, you know, to be one of those face of baseball kind of guys.